everyone, welcome back to my channel Team Prakti. I hope you all are doing great. Hi, if you are watching me for the first time, my name is Tamali. I do make videos on related to resin art, sculpture painting, home decor, DIYs, bottle art, mixed media, decoupage and many more. So if you like this kind of tutorial, you can subscribe my channel Team Crafty and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you get all the notification whenever I posted a new video. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can make a beautiful yet very easy resin nameplate. So for that, I'm going to take this MDF board and I have already attached a hook on the back side. I will use this chalk paint from Areen Chalk Paint and these are so beautifully pigmented and I will show you how you can make some pattern with this kind of chalk paint color. So here I have taken two, three different shades of teal blue. And I'm going to make a pattern with it. So here is a trick that I'm going to show you that if you are not applying anything like primer on your base, your chalk paint will get dissolved. You can see this chalk paint is dissolved by this MDF. So it doesn't look proper or good. So that is why we have to always apply gesso on our MDF board before applying any color on your MDF board. So here I'm going to apply a good amount of gesso and I will let it dry for another two to three hours for complete drying and then I will start my coloring. All the materials that I'm going to use in this particular video all will be listed down in the description box and where I have purchased all this item. So you can check this out and you can purchase for yourself as well. Once my basic gesso layer is dried, I'm going to start the chalk paint. So here I will, you know, apply a two, three different shades of chalk paint and I will create a background. So it is completely up to you that how you like to color your background. I have used this chalk paint and this is really really good in quality and it is completely matte now I will use some crystals and I will go to color it with my spray paint and with the copper gold color so here I'm going to do the design this is the simply it's a design that you can make just add a bit gold or you know copper color crystals on the both side of your nameplate and attach your names with the cutouts so here I have taken the cutouts from MDF and I have also spray painted it with the same color, that golden copper color. 
and I'm going to use it as my basic color so it does look super aesthetic and super good and yet very easy to use everything is attached i have mixed 2 is to 1 ratio of clear resin and i'm going to pour it on your background so first i'm going to pour it to seal the crystals and then i will cover the whole base with this resin so it will look super super good and trust me nobody will you know understand that you completely paint it and then you will cover it with the resin it will looks like a proper resin art so it is simple and yet very easy i have made for one of my friend's house so you can make also this kind of items for your own and let me know in the comment sections below that how you like this video and how you like this easiest ideas of resin template because i have already posted a resin template which is bit tricky and a complete resin art so i have got so many requests that please ma'am show something easiest way to make this kind of resin template so here it is so do try it for your own home and please do say, share this video or photos of your project with me on my instagram i love to see your creations so once you're resin pouring is done make sure you have scrap all the surface properly and you you have to wait for 24 hours for the complete drying kind of content will help you to create something unique for your own home and please do share this video with your friends and family so that is it for today's tutorial see you on my next video till then take care and goodbye